We're very lucky here at Macquarie. We have access to world-leading research facilities in the form of the Australian Astronomical Observatory and the CSIRO Astronomy and Space Science Department. And this gives our students unique access to world-renowned researchers and they get to work with these people um, on a one-to-one -one basis. Jack and Braun are getting a particularly valuable experience, seeing a project develop from its inception up until the point where it will gather some real, unique scientific data that can be used as part of a piece of professional research. To see that within the scope of a single term unit I think is quite remarkable. Jack and Braun were working with us on the Huntsman Eye project, a project to do astronomical imaging in a new way using ordinary camera lenses. Today the students are measuring the performance of the camera we'll be using. The AAO isn't really a normal workplace as you would imagine it. Everyone was really interested in what was going on um, and ready to help when we had problems. Jack and Braun have not just been performing an incidental task, but they've actually been integrated as part of a professional team. They've formed a critical component of that team. They've conducted work that was actually crucial to a major project going forward. This camera allows us to see extremely faint things, things you just couldn't see before. And I'm excited about bringing the PACE students into it because they're going to help us put things together and test them out. Tonight we're at Macquarie University Observatory to do some initial testing with the Huntsman Eye imaging system with our Macquarie PACE students to make sure the system works as we expect before we take it to a dark side to observe near Coonabarabran. We've come up from Sydney, we're about 10 k's out of Coonabarabran to do the first scientific test of the Huntsman Eye, which is the, the camera lens and imaging system that we've been developing. And it's the first time that we're able to test it in a, a site with a good altitude, not much light pollution, and actually get some scientific results. It's absolutely fantastic. It's far more involved than I thought it was going to be. You feel completely part of the team. A lot of people just do their degree and don't get to actually go out and do something really interesting with it. This is an amazing opportunity to actually do some science. This afternoon we're visiting the Anglo-Australian Telescope, which is Australia's largest optical telescope, so that the students can see some cutting-edge astronomy technology firsthand. The students were able to see the telescope in action, moving uh, for full range of movement, and also see the 2DF fibre positioner robot in action. It enables us to observe 400 stars or galaxies at a time in detail. After returning from the observing run, uh, Jack and Braun spent some time uh, analysing the data that we'd gathered. At the end of the project, Jack and Braun presented the details of the project and what they'd found at Macquarie University. It's actually quite satisfying to stand up in front of people and, and tell them what you've learned and what you know and to answer their questions and to really see that you've informed them on something that you've learned about. It's nerve-wracking at first but when you get up there and you start talking you realise that you do enjoy it and you do know quite a bit about it. The good thing about being involved in the PACE project is that you have lots of time to be involved in it. We were working on one project for the whole semester and we were able to understand a lot more of the background knowledge about what it's about. This is quite inspiring for any student. It's been very important for them to see the things that they've been learning in classes being applied to a professional environment and being surrounded by people who are excited about the work that they are doing. PACE units are a really good way of getting involved in what you think you might be doing in the future and actually seeing what that would be like in real life. This PACE project has actually opened the door for me professionally straight away. I've got a, a research grant to work on the very same project for five to six weeks. The ultimate goal of an education at university is to develop the entire student, not just to focus on specific skills. And the PACE unit really allows us to do that. <laughs>